trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, they'd have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there, you and me, we shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. But if they've captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella, Kinnereth, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. What are they doing? Where are they going? To go inside. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Whoa. Yes, Papa. Get these prisoners out of the carts. Move it! Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, dear. You've got to tell them! We weren't with you! This is a mistake! Get towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. <laughs> Raylof of Riverwood. No care of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you? You picked a bad time to come home to Skyrim, Kinsman. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least you'll die here, in your homeland. Follow the captain, prisoner. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. 
As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the Eight Divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. Our beloved. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? Fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Nord and the Rags. Here it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy.
again in Sodom Guard, brother. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. You may as well take Gunyar's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. That armor on Gunyar isn't... All right. Get that armor on, and give that axe a few swings. I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. the key. Let's see if it opens that door. That's it. Come on. Let's get out of here before the drag. Let's go. any potions. We'll need them. Done. Let's get moving. Troll's blood. It's a torture room. Hear that? Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this cage. Ah, it's locked. See if you can get it open with some picks. Might need that gold once we get out. Grab anything useful and let's go. See if we can find a way out of here. Let's see where this goes. We're going back that way now. If 
better push on. The rest of them will have to find another way out. doesn't go anywhere. I guess we better try this way. Those damn things. Too many eyes, no? My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. Better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. But I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's over. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. I guess you get used to it.
These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead. See for yourself. Warrior, good. Those stars will guide you to honor and glory. Now, is it? Please, Mom. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. And I've got better things to do than listen to more of your fantasies. You'll see. It was a dragon. It'll kill us all, and then you'll believe me. Nobody believes me, but I tell you, I saw a dragon. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. Maybe... Never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's some telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Pod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. Pod, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? I'll be right down. Uncle Rayla, can I see your axe? How many Imperials have you killed? Do you really know Alfred Stormcloak? Hush, Frodnar. This is no time for your games. Go and watch the South Road. Come find us if you see any Imperial soldiers coming. Mama, I want to stay and talk with Uncle Rayla. Look at you. Almost a grown man. Won't be long before you'll be joining the fight yourself. That's right. Don't worry, Uncle Rayla. I won't let those soldiers sneak up on you. Now, Rayla, what's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Ooh, where to start? Well, the news you heard about Alfric was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards! They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real live... I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. 
The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Thanks, sister. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It'll take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric Stormcloak. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Good luck, brother. I'll see you later. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay low. I'm glad to help any way I can. I told you my sister would help us out. So you saw a dragon, did you? Tell me, what was it like? As big as a house? Well, I'll be. That'd be a sight to see. Uh, not that I actually want to see one, understand. <laughs> I hope that dragon stays far away from here. Hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. Faithless Imperials. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Maybe you could talk some sense into my pig-headed brother. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, so northeast of town. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. 
Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar you hear the Red me? who came riding to yep. White Run from Hell's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears the after all. Did Just make sure we get a fresh bastard. He told of both battles in gold he had made. But then he went quiet. You're that visitor been poking around. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Word is Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War is only going to get worse now. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. We drink to our youth. Need a room? Today's Talk to Delphine. For the age of aggression is just there have been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino, been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. With our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. Some fool is opening a museum in Dawnstar. They say he's paying people to collect artifacts from that old mythic Dawn cult. Have you seen that shrine of Azura? They say the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Sight to see. Word is, Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War's only gonna get worse now. Until next time. You're that visitor been poking around. Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. You may be right. Camilla may see Feindel as little more than a friend, but why take chances? Here, give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. Tell her it's from Feindel. Truly? So maybe my mother isn't crazy after all. You had best tell the Jarl in Whiterun. He needs to know about this. Lucan's got a little bit of everything at the Riverwood Trader. If you need weapons or armor, see Alvor, the blacksmith. Mm hmm.
next Imperial I see is dead. We'll show those faithless dogs who this land belongs to. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. One of those horrors comes here. We'll be ready. been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. Got to go. Fine, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. Brigands, I can handle. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it, you. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. You there. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? We're vampire hunters. We search out and destroy those blood-sucking scum wherever we find them. You're not paying attention, then, like almost everyone else around here. Haven't you heard that the Hall of the Vigilance was destroyed by vampires? They never took the threat seriously, and now they paid the price. The Vigilance mostly hunt down Daedra worshippers. Which is why they got torn to pieces when they went up against vampires. That's why our leader, Isran, is re-establishing the Dawn Guard. Real serious vampire hunters. Ha! Huh. Isran's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawn Guard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawn Guard material. Something to say? Need supplies? See Bellathor at his store. Sleazy little man. But he has good stock. 
Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Well, there's Nothing. no telling what it means. My lord, please. This is no time for rash action. I just think we need more information before we act. I just... Who's this then? Well, I trust you have something vitally important to tell me. Important enough to interrupt me in the middle of council? Gerda owns the lumber mill, if I'm not mistaken. Pillar of the community, not prone to flights of fancy. And you're sure Helgen was destroyed by a dragon? This wasn't some Stormcloak raid gone wrong? Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute, especially now. What I want to know is, what exactly happened at Helga? I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the Jarl the dragon of is lurking in the mountains. Will view that is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my yard. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps? Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Faringar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Ah, no mere brute mercenary but a thinker, perhaps even a scholar? You see, when the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dismissed them as mere fantasies, rumors, impossibilities. One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleakfall's Barrow. A dragonstone, 
said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. An old tomb built by the ancient Nords, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. Well, must preserve some professional secrets, must we? I have my sources. Reliable sources. I'm not surprised you've never heard of it. Even I used to think it was just a myth. But not anymore. The Dragon War was a real event, although only the barest glimmer of the actual events has come down to us. Far back in the mythic era, the dragons were worshipped as gods in Skyrim. Many of the monumental ruins that still dot the landscape were in fact built as temples to the dragons. The details are lost, but at some point, the Nords rebelled. After a long and terrible war, the Nords overthrew their dragon overlords. Oh no, many were killed, of course, but many survived into historical times. Why? This very palace was built by one of Valgruf's ancestors to hold a captive dragon. Hence its name, Dragon's Reach. I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salt for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia will provide some form of recompense. Good. You're clearly better suited than I am to carry out such a menial task. If I said that was a tedious question, would you be smart enough to know what I meant? Probably not. As long as I'm left alone to pursue my research, I don't care who gives the orders. Now, I'm a busy man, and your pointless questions are boring me terribly. Good day. This is a priority now. Anything we can use to fight this dragon, or dragons, we need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Yao Valgruf. You seem to have found me an able assistant. I'm sure he will prove most useful. Succeed at this. And you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. I serve Jarl Balgruf as steward. All this standing around is rubbish. We should be taking the fight to the Stormcloaks. The Jarl is, as you can imagine, very busy. Perhaps I can assist you. I'm not a man. I'm a weapon in human form. Just unsheath me and point me at the enemy. One of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat rare. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the Bannered Mare from Hulda. About the same as everyone else? They're the cat folk of Elsewhere. Great warriors, good traders. The way I hear it, Elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You'd do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Farewell.
anybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Pardon me, but do I detect a case of the rattles? I've... Ah, splendid, splendid. It's for a special brew I'm working on. A love elixir like none other. Maybe I'll test it on Faringar first. Oh, but I suppose you expect some compensation. Um, here. These potions should suffice. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. What of my son, hmm? What of Thorold? Is he nothing? So don't talk to me about suffering. Those green apples you sold me the Your other son day. chose his side and he chose poorly, and now he's gone. Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. I'm sure you never accept My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, battle boys, where is he? Where are you holding my forearm? Come and see my selection of the finest huh. weapons. Do you believe this old hag? Holding him? Why, I've got him in my cellar. He's my prisoner. Face it, cow. Your stupid son is dead. He died a storm cloaked traitor. And you, you best keep your mouth shut before you the suffer the same. Sense. Fresh from the wilds. Come on, Father. There's nothing more to be said here. All I can think about is my son, my Thorold. They say that he was killed, but I know better. I know my son is alive. Those battle born, they're in with the Imperials. They know it, too. And yet they lie to my very face. I just... I just know it. I can feel it in my heart. You have to believe me. Please visit me at my home. I can tell you the whole story. Are you still working at the Bannered Mare in the, the finest cuts, here? fresh from the wilds. And why shouldn't I? Just because I'm a gray mane doesn't mean I can't earn my own keep. I didn't mean... I'm sorry I asked. What's the matter? You can't stand the sight of a strong Nord woman? Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. Oh, it took years. But I earned my way to the top. I own Chilfero Farm, you see. Very successful business. Tomorrow, just don't hit me. Welcome to our home, Mother. What's the meaning of this? Who have you brought into our home? Averstein, put that down. He's here to help us find Coral. How do we know he's not spying for the Battleborn? This was foolish. We can't trust anyone. Who knows what they'll do if they find me here. I can't take any more of this. No weapons, please. Let's just talk. All right, Mother. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? So, you're here to help? My brother Thorald, he was fighting for the Stormcloaks and went missing. Everyone assumes he's dead. But he's not, I just know it. The Imperials captured him, and they're holding him someplace. The Battleborns know where. I'd go and search their house for proof, but they want me to. I'd be captured, and then we'll never know what happened to him. So I need someone to find that proof for me. The 
Battleborns, the Emperor's biggest bootlickers here in Whiterun. Their connections to the Empire and the Legion are well known. When Thorald didn't return home, there was no question in my mind. They knew Thorald supported the Stormcloaks, knew he was gonna aid them in battle, made sure he didn't come back. Locked him up someplace to get back at my family. I'm sure of it. Anything that confirms that Thorald isn't dead, but is being held captive, I know those Battleborns have it. They'd be hiding it, of course. Wouldn't want it to get out that they've been lying this whole time. But you might be able to butter them up enough to lower their guard. Best if you didn't mention to anyone that you saw me here. afford to send anyone else and we don't know where the dragon is you tried mercenary work job, it might suit you and get the people to safety if the town is attacked i don't expect the three of you to fight off a dragon by yourselves but i do expect you to do your duty of course we'll keep riverwood safe you can count on it let's move out times are wasting we can never rest easy for Balgruf's enemies will not. Balgruf and I share a battle bond. We met as youth and forged our friendship in the fires of war. When he became Jarl, I insisted on serving as his protector. He had no cause to argue. Gods, you are curious. Almost dangerously so. I am charged with protecting the Jarl from any and all threats. Powerful men have many enemies, more so in times of strife, so you can imagine the dangers. Oh yes, there have been attempts on the Jarl's life. More than one would-be assassin has met his end at the tip of my blade. Take your pick. Dragons, Stormcloak assassins, ambitious and unscrupulous nobles. Sometimes I think his own children want him dead. And those are just the physical threats. Assaults on his sanity are another matter entirely. Every day he deals with obsequious functionaries and incompetent bureaucrats. Sadly, I'm not allowed to eliminate them. Well, not yet anyway. I've got my eyes on you. Damn those great mains to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks, they'll get what's coming to them. Have news? Did you find something? I knew it. Let me see, please. The Thalmor. By the Nine. It's worse than I thought. So, North Watch Keep. Then we know where to hit him. I'll do anything if it means saving my brother. You'll join us, won't you? Thorald can't be left to those monsters. Are you sure? I doubt you stand a chance against the Thalmor. I can have a group of men ready at a moment's notice. Many would be willing to help rescue my brother. Very well. I'll give you a chance. But if you can't do it, I will.
That's privileged information. Now, move along. Are you joking? Even if we had a prisoner by that name, the only way he'd be released is by order of the Imperial Legion. Now, I suggest you turn around and go back the way you came. Mm-hmm. You there? What are you doing? I never thought I'd see another friendly face again. We need to get to safety as soon as possible. Let's move. Someone there. What was that?
enough for rescuing me from this place. I suspect I'd never again see the light of day otherwise. But why would you risk your life for me, a stranger? He must have been very convincing. I cannot stay. Not here. Not in Whiterun. It likely won't be safe for Avelstein either. Our best hope now is to fall in with the ranks of the Stormcloaks. But would you do me a favor? Tell my mother to suffer the winter's cold wind, for it bears aloft next summer's seeds. She'll know what it means. I thank you again, friend. You've given me my life back. This war is as stupid as a few who plan great. Please ahead. tell me you have news of my son. Is he? You've saved him? Oh, I must see him at once. What? After all this, I can't even see him? How? How do I know you're telling me the truth and not just what I want to hear? For it bears aloft. Next summer's seeds. That's my boy. So it's true then. For now it's enough to know that he's alive. I can find peace in that. Thank you, dear friend. You've given me back my son. I'd had the Orland forge this for Thorald. It was to be a present for his return. I suppose he can't have it now. Why don't you take it? We can always make another for the day when this war ends and Thorold can come home. No, nor do I expect to. Would be too dangerous for now. It's enough for me to know that he's out there somewhere, and not locked up like some animal in a cage. <laughs> I can tell you're new around here asking a question like that. My husband, Eorland, tends the Skyforge up at Yorvaskar. The Companion's Mead Hall. Oh, there's no finer smith in the Nine Halls. You should ask him about his work. It's the only subject that'll get him talking. Well, that and maybe those stuck-up, dung-sniffing battleborns. Don't even get me started on that lot. Huh. They put on airs like there's something special. Oh, sure, they've got money, but they ain't got a shred of honor between them. Grey Mane. Huh. Now that's a name fills you with pride. We've got roots in White Run. We've got history. You take care of yourself now. <laughs> <laughs>